This week, Rogers State University is playing host to around 300 high school juniors from across the state. Fox 23's Amy Heibel shows us how the Boys State program teaches students how to govern at the state and local level. The majority of this bill passes. From a vote in the mock state house on allowing naps during this week's Boys State. Is, is there a limit on how many people that apply for this are going to be allowed to have these funds? To a bill in the mock state Senate to allow funding for work opportunities for those with developmental disabilities. The goal of these sessions? And these folks need to know how their government works because they're going to be living under it for the rest of their lives. That first part shows you have an understanding of where they've been and you're showing them that on that way. Commander Corey Brooks, the director of the Oklahoma American Legion Boys State, explains what he hopes these young men will walk away with at the end of the week-long leadership program. A respect for the veterans that serve to make this country free and keep it free, a respect for the flag and the nation and what it means to be an American, and a deeper knowledge of the greatness of the democratic way of doing government. What the program is not about? And trying to encourage them and challenge them to be better than what's going on today. Attendees are like their own officials, from city mayors all the way up to the governor and lieutenant governor. Smith Langham, who is lieutenant governor for Boy State, explains. We just make sure everyone's voice is heard and accept that we aren't going to all have the same views or backgrounds. And it's not even uh, that one side is wrong or one side is incorrect, but it's that we all think differently and that's okay. And we can learn from each other and how we think differently and come to a conclusion and sometimes a compromise. At the end of the week, two participants will be selected to attend the American Legion Boy Boys Nation in Washington, D.C. Reporting at Rogers State University, covering news that matters, I'm Amy Hybels, Fox 23 News.